Yes, oh yes, we uh, got, got caught midstream, sorry. Multitasking.
No difference between us and you guys, but you guys no, have to I'm like not saying lower, than, saying lower than you guys. But unfortunately, you know, this, well, is, not my, this is, is not my property to okay, say that we, you guys we, can we stay we here. Still, we, can stay, we can still sit right here and do what we want to do right here, as long as we're not camping here. Don't get it twisted. We know we're fucking right. We're going to fence it off, so that's why we need See, that's what they wait for. It's all about fishing things off. That's all it is. It's all about fishing things off. It's all about fishing things off. It just makes our case even stronger, which. You know what I'm saying? You, you don't want it. You don't, it just shows prejudice. Straight the fuck up. If it can fix up anything that you're going to, then it, 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 it's okay. Then you don't have to deal with it. That's all it is. They're just going to fence off all the public property until. Yeah, that's all it is. It's all public property, 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 but they're going to fence it up. That's what they do. Park, we'll go to the park but they won't have a ticket given to them. We'll go to the park but it's all money, all money. We'll and that's the parents' creation. We'll we'll the kids are with the parks. And I stay true on that. Because, I mean, we're able to be here. I'm not talking about the same way it is. As is. And they will see. VIT is VIT, the thing that you cannot see. But now we will go to park. And we can see me there, I who I am anyway, so it doesn't matter. What? Betty yourself? I mean, seriously? How many rooms do you have? You just said we weren't better than you, but now you're saying better yourself. No, but they offered, they came here offering no services. No services at all. Martin versus Boys is case. It is allowable activity. In fact, you should fucking hear this shit that I have right here with Martin versus Boys because maybe you'll understand what Martin, who Martin versus Boys is. He's the only one that, you know, is. We'll, we'll figure something out for him. What is your name? One man. Let's see, if you can, let's see if you can have one man. Let's see if you can do it for one person. I want to see this. One person is man right here. Just tell, tell her what his name is. Let's see. Let's see where you. Let's see where you're gonna send him. I want to see this. Fornication all the time. What's up this? Yeah, you know I mean, you, you think that you think that. Not allowed to stay in the shelters. Yeah, and I want to see you place him. You place him. He can go. Here's. Show me. Just keep on spinning. No, no, no. We gotta get out of here. But you know what? It's a roof over his head. He's warm at night, and he he's and he's safe. And he's fed. That's right. So it's one service. There's no service. service. We've tried so many services for him. If there were services available. Or in California. Yeah. 
we call the shelter. And most, be, most people need paperwork, and what this warming center has done is taken people to the DMV, get them their papers together. That's what they need. They need a stable way to live life, but they can't even do that if you put them in a service where they eventually just end up in a criminalization pipeline. So we're, we're like I said, we discussed this. This is beyond anything that you don't just coming here and telling you guys, it's like it's been vetted through everybody in the county. Well, I'm not a lot of work for Boise, because that's law. Right. Yeah, we should discuss something that's going to solve the situation. So that, that's, that's kind of, we've been vetted, that's why we're here, or else we wouldn't be here, right? We would have just come out, we know this is an ongoing thing. We wouldn't come out here not knowing that the county has done their research, and this is the county property, they got to go. I don't agree with that. And that's, that's how do you, perfectly fine. That's what you have in the yeah. tradition. How do you, how do you feel like, like we're not, you're not better than us if that's all you, like, like you in the conversation like that? Oh, well, you know, they decided, so therefore you got to so go. You Don't you critically that? think about, well, what's going to happen to these folks? Where are they going to go after this? Are they going to be the county's problem? Are they going to be Watsonville's problem? Are they going to be Monterey County's problem? Right, so what I'm saying is we're at this point, it's not like a negotiation. I know that. have an attorney. Yeah. He's doing what he needs to do. So it, it, it's kind of where we're at, right? So, so we're, we're just supposedly op opposed to each other. Because, because you're, you're just, you're not interested in people, you're interested in following an order. What is going to happen to these people is who you should be asking and saying, how do I actually fulfill my job to make sure that these folks have justice too? Because they need to be somewhere. Are we trying to bury them alive? So please tell your bosses that this is wrong. I will do it because I get paid to, but I don't like it. And I'd like you to find something else to do. That's their job, peacemaking, okay? It ain't no peacemaking. No, just enforcing the laws that they're told to enforce. But you know, these people have constitutional rights. Are they supposed to die? No, of course not. They need an address. They need to be somewhere. Everywhere you keep on fencing off, well, how does that help? You guys, you guys are here one time because this, this is going to be a big long kind of experience. You're just fighting my account. All of the things that I'm saying. You're, you're only trying to protect one side of things instead of everybody, which really negates the whole point of you being in service. You guys listen to this. In 2019, the Ninth Circuit ruled nope, in the Martin Luther King case that governments may not enforce ordinances that ban public camping unless they first provide enough shelter needs. Everybody, 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 everybody. 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 In, everybody. 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 Or in the pandemic, is available on the Ventura City. That's the whole well, only for Ventura City, only within their jurisdiction. Slash safe and clean. Thank you for sharing your thoughts. Yeah. If you have a question, right on, governments may not. Oh, what is the Martin versus? Yeah, yeah. We're well, trying to make sure that nobody's in so this is not public space, right? right? Where's public space? Where's, so where's some public space at? Can you tell me where the public spaces are? Yeah, you, uh, we're almost all loaded. We're almost all loaded. So, so you want to collapse there? Uh, if you have a question, please submit it via the city's safe and clean website. We may feature it on a future video. <laughs> we're, we're, we're almost done, so let's, just, let's get everything loaded. Okay. And we could take our time. Well, not very much, but... Let's, I, I take the canopy? someone that one. Ricky, help me bring the bowl. They need to hear it one more time. That's the law. And you can learn more by looking at the law. That's the law. What, what is the law? What does law mean? And you can learn more by looking at the Martin vs. Boise case. They just said for the paycheck.
to house every person experiencing homelessness with their seat. All of this information and much more is available on the Ventura City website at cityofventura.ca.gov. Thank you for sharing your concerns. If you have a question, please submit it via the city's safe and clean website. You may feature it on a future video. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> 
public assistance disrespecting disrespecting people, disrespecting human rights, they, it's not okay. It's not okay. That's not public service. That's disrespectful. That's that disrespectfulness to the badge, to the oath. You know, I mean, they don't take their oath serious. They don't take their oath Liberty and justice for all. For all. all. Not, not let's pick and, let's pick and choose who we protect. You know what I'm saying? But they should have put and said, you know what, we have these services. Or came down here with some pamphlets, like, you know, at least Watsonville does. They come down here with pamphlets and give us resources. And they could came down with some resources, but they gave no resources except for the fact that they want all the resources was that they would cite us and arrest us for trespassing. One phone call, maybe, because while we're down here, not not one time, but one time, an officer did come down here, and that was her to let us know to see what we're doing. But any other time, there has not been no calls down here for anybody as far as legal actions or legal things going on. There has been no complaints as far as anybody doing illegal activity here. There has been nothing like that. We're, we we all go to sleep at night, and we're comfortable at night, and we we have not had no complaints or nobody run upon us at all, at all. Peaceful. Peaceful. But they are the ones that make it in. And I even, I did, I did even have, you know, on the, uh, you know, on the outside, it did say that we were peaceful protesting. We, we thank the community because we have had a lot of community support out here, you know, that have been, they've been great, gracious enough to bring us food and water and, you know, blankets and other materials and stuff like that for us to be comfortable. But you know what? The yeah, sheriffs, the, the sheriffs just want to take it away. They don't want to give nobody, they don't want to give nobody the opportunity to be able to be at peace or, you know, where is the homeless community supposed to go here in Watsonville? Back into the business areas? I was trying to take people out of the business areas and out of the parks. You know, right here was a safe place to be. We were in nobody's way, nobody's way. So now we'll just go in their way. We'll be in their way and in their face. I would like to know where there's, public, where there's a public space that's for Sheriff and PD. Because I want to let them know that this is not okay. It's not okay. Gotta be somewhere. We need an address. And now look, they're roping it off. Is that the um, gate? Yeah. Oh yeah, well, uh, yeah, for right now. fence company. For right now. Roping it off for what? Right what are they roping it off for? Was there a murder here or something? No, th this is, uh, th yeah. once they place a the line murdered, and you go on the other side the of the line, community. that will be trespassing. The sheriff's, ho the sheriff's murdered the homeless community. No, it's the councilman and councilwoman too, man. They, mm -hmm. they got a big blame uh, in this too, Michael. The city manager, yeah, the city, city manager, attorney, and the mayor, and all them too. And, and the the continuum of care. Yep. Yeah. The mayor has a big responsibility. Every, everyone who gets paid to say they help people when they don't. Exactly. Where are they? Where have they been? They haven't been here. Yeah. Not for this whole trip. Yeah, they came out, Community Action Board came out one time, and, and they, they set people up in those hotels, but that was only because they were forced to. Yeah, they, they, they don't... Brain, and it wouldn't make it look bad on them, that's what it is. Because when the people see it, it make it look bad on them. That's what they try to prevent. Basically, that's the only reason. Like that's the only reason why. Well, I mean, you know, look bad on them. This see, right here, every... See people that is bad in this cold... Am I murdered or what? Why are you guys taking it off? <laughs> it's, it's the temporary fence. Yeah, once they do this, we cannot be inside. So we need we need to vacate the uh, the lot. And to get a bed, you have to have to go through this process. But nobody is a walk up, get a shelter kind of fucking deal. Nobody. We need to be somewhere 24 hours a day. Right now, this is public service. <sighs> oh.
<sighs> you know, I would take pride in doing my job. My friend got ran over, motherfuckers third time on a hit and run, and you guys let him go. And you guys, you Why aren't you over there arresting that guy? Why aren't you harassing him? Because you guys don't know how to do your job. You're over here harassing the homeless. There's a man right here who has nothing. This man right here, the, uh, the man that's in the wheelchair right there, he has no place to go. No shelter will take him. No shelter will take him because of his because his bathroom habits. Okay? We set up porta potty. We set up a little porta potty, a portable one for him, so he can use the restroom. Okay? Yet they want to take that away from him. They want to take the fact that he's able to be warm at night, be sheltered at night. They want to take that away from him. Actually, they took it away from him. These are our sheriffs, our Santa Cruz County sheriffs. They offered no services when they came down here. Not one. They had no resources either when they came down here. Not one resource. Not one resource they have when they came down here at all. These officers are doing illegal activity. They offered no housing, no, no opportunities, no nothing. Martin versus Boise states that it is allowable activity to camp. If you do not have, if, if they, and you cannot cite nobody, if you don't have proper, if there are, if there are, there has to be as many beds for everybody, everybody in the city. They have to provide beds for everybody in the city in order for them to cite somebody or tell them that they cannot camp somewhere. Yeah, and anytime you see me, you can stop pulling me over, ask for weapons and drugs and do all your bullshit. <laughs> so we're, we're waiting for the gate to be put up here because this is going to make the case even stronger. Which is, it just puts out that Santa Cruz County and Watsonville City are definitely prejudiced against people that are homeless. That is Officer Luna with the Santa Cruz County Sheriff's Department. She's the one who made this decision. I was wondering, can I get a, a card? Please. Right, you're Luna, right? Yep. And that's the number because this is a bad number on there. Excellent. It's an old one. All right.